The Zeppin Micro 2 camera slider with or without the motor is currently one of the best values on the market. While it does still have its limitations, they're working hard to eliminate those one by one and today we'll talk about one small but significant annoyance that they have fixed. So let's get into it. Hey, this is Take Two, a new series of short videos highlighting key features of products that I really love. And today, like I said, we're talking about a small but powerful upgrade to the Zeppelin Micro 2 slider motor. When they first released their motor module, which can either be added onto an existing slider or purchased as one single unit, you got all the essential controls with a very basic and easy to use user interface, except for one major control, looped motion. This is a key ability for things like interviews when you want the motion to continuously loop back and forth. And although you could access that option through the mobile app, it was a really not so advanced feature that I did hope they would add to the physical controls. And they did. You can now download a firmware update, link in the video description, which is also now available for both Windows or Mac, and updating via the mobile app should be coming in the future. The process may vary slightly for Windows users, but basically download the installer and give permission to your computer to open the software if necessary. Open the software and before connecting the USB cable, boot your slider into update mode by holding down both arrow buttons at the same time and then push the power button while you're holding those down. Then connect the USB cable, drop that firmware file into the updater we just opened and wait till it finishes. Make sure to remember after the file is 100% loaded, you still need to wait until the light is green on your slider before removing the USB cable. Once it's updated, you'll still set A and B points in the same way as before, moving to that position and double pressing the power button to set a mark. Again, as before, once those are set, double pressing the power button once more will start a single movement of that selected path. Now to access this new looped functionality, you can hold down either of the arrow buttons and while holding down, tap the power button. This will start your looped motion. While you do still need the mobile app to get more advanced controls like more than two waypoints or advanced speed control, you can still cycle through the three speed settings on the slider itself by single pushing the power button as always. And that's it. Now the Zeppelin Micro 2 can take full advantage of all of the most common needs without having to connect to the mobile app. But for now, if you have any questions or comments, please leave them down below and I will do my best to get back to you as soon as I can. If you liked this video or found it helpful, don't forget to give it a thumbs up and subscribe if you haven't already. As always, thank you for watching.